Right, I'm just going to give you a quick demonstration of aqua panel. Well, a few people ask me, say, what's the difference? And so, a uh, cement board, it can be a bit of a nightmare to work with, i.e. cutting and fixing, it's slower. This is a lot quicker to install. We don't use plasterboard. We don't use wood. Uh, this is the stuff to use a cement board. The reason why, I mean, this can hold about 50 kilos per square meter. If it's fixed right, we've screwed here every 200 square and also what we've done is we've staggered the joints we've brick bonded the balls the reason for doing this is because then if you're going off a stud and you were to create a line up here and go from board and have a straight line you're creating a weakness if you're using a large format tire if there's any movement that's going to crack all the way down that line so by doing this and offsetting the joints you're strengthening uh, the wall so then we use a tape, apple panel tape, hardy backer tape, it's a little bit different to plaster tape, and it uh, basically won't rot when you put it on. Now you leave a three to five mil joint on the walls when you put it up. The reason being is so we can get adhesive in between the joints and um, it makes it stronger when you're filling them. So, should have done this before I started. Right, and what we're going to do is find the end, and then, uh -huh, there it is. Right, I just get a trowel, no need for a knife, and all we're going to do is start in a minute. Now this is self-adhesive as well. I would do this the, as you're going to fill the joints, don't do this the day before because it will fall off overnight. And literally, like that, run it down nice and light, and then just one quick action like that, and it will, and then let's overlap, and just overlapping that, just about there, like that, okay, again, in the corner. Now you don't have to go mad, and it's really happy it in, it's just literally sticking to like that. Okay, into that corner, like that. Again. Okay, no need for a knife, flat like that, pinch it, pull it. Like that. Okay, I'll do the rest in a minute. Now the other thing as well, mix up a little bit of adhesive and then just literally push it in, straighten it off and leave it. Steel seal. If you're still going to use a primer on this because it will suck the moisture out of the adhesive and if you're using a large format tile and you're using a slow set adhesive you need that curing time. So seal it, 3 to 1 with a tile master or SBR, go with that, it will stop the suction and you're good to go. In the shower area you still can tank it, you can still tank the, the corners uh, for extra protection. And you're good to go.